You might think the only person who could be trusted with your love life is you, right? Wrong. Enter the board of dating, a group of friends, family, and even coworkers you enlist to do the choosing for you. Guided by a relationship expert, that's me, Spicy Mari. They're not leaving until they make a match. Because when it comes to dating, we could all use a little help. This is Board of Dating. I get to meet Benison today. Hi, I'm Benison. I'm 26 and I work in sales. Dating life has been chill. I've been single for a little bit. He seems like, you know, he really wants a relationship, but what exactly is he doing wrong? I haven't put in the work to like really find a girl. I just like, I'm not putting myself out there. I want to see what he's really looking for in a woman and how self-aware he is. Hi. You've been waiting for me now. I have, I have. Welcome, welcome. You're a person. I can't wait to figure out what is going on in that brain of yours. I mean, tell me what does an ideal relationship look like for you? What are your relationship goals? So I've never really had a real relationship. It's been more like things. And what do you think is holding you back from finding someone? I think I'm just trying to do me and understand me so that I could do that for someone else. Majority men feel like everything needs to be perfectly put into place before they start finding someone to share their life with. Something that might be important to you, which is commitment. Commitment's number one. Just to have someone by my side to do that and just feel that way every day with in the future would be fire. Describe to me who are the lucky winners who get to be a part of your board. Hi, uh, my name is Michael. I've known since like sixth grade, we were learning like how to write complete sentences together in essays and yeah, it's wild. I'm June, I'm Benison's coworker and I've known him for about a year and a half. She understands what I like and the kind of jokes and humor I have. And I think like she will be good at like spotting who would appreciate that maybe, or like who's kind of like in the same realm. I'm Lucas and I've known Benison since high school. He's way more mellow than me, but like I think like he sees and feels, I think a lot of what I see and feel. Well, I think Benison's like a character. Oh, definitely. That's what makes him unique, like a cartoon. He's always talking to his fans on Instagram. Bro. 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 Yeah. This is fire, dude, fire. <laughs> oh, that's the one right there. <laughs> this is fire. They've been around me for enough, like enough time to know like this is Benison. He could make the most out of any opportunity. Very energetic. Very loud. <laughs> In a good way though. In a good way, yeah. I think Benison should be with a girl who is very outgoing as well. She doesn't necessarily have to match his level because his level is like, on a, yeah, it's like a different stratosphere. Okay, so now describe to me what you think you need a woman. Compassionate, adventurous, curious. It may help you to write a list. On the left-hand side, write everything you want. If you could just build the ultimate human, mm -hmm. nobody's perfect. But then on the right-hand side, write a list of everything that you need, mm -hmm. what you cannot live without. Talk to me a little bit about like who has a relationship that you've admired. My mom always says my dad chased her everywhere she went. Are they still in love? I wish they would show it more. I wish they would like be kissing all the time and like doing what they used to do and just like, I don't know. Other than that, they're definitely in love. They like sacrifice their whole damn life so I can like do what I'm doing right now. It's nuts. What would a girl who's dating you now expect if you brought her home to your parents? I've never actually brought a girl home. Never? No. It's just like bringing a girl home is kind of a big deal. And like Korean specific is very important to them when it comes to like who I settle with. Not only like comfort, but like practicality. Mom's always like, how am I supposed to talk to your girl? She doesn't speak Korean. Like, <laughs> am I supposed to send her like emojis or something? I'm like, mom, chill, we'll figure it out. So it's like, yo, what if I bring a girl and I teach her Korean every day? And she's like, she speaks better than me. Mom's like, make that happen. Why do you feel like you're ready for a relationship now or to start dating seriously now? So I mentioned earlier, like, I want to be at this like crazy perfect spot. So I've gotten to this place where I'm like, I'm kind of beautiful the way I am. Like, I'm kind of like, <laughs> Like, and I feel that to the core. Maybe it's like a journey that I do with someone, or maybe someone helps me get there, or maybe I help someone, whatever that may be. It's like, this process doesn't have to be a solo project. I do think that if he found the right person, it would only like enhance his life experience. Someone who like gave him that wind beneath his wings, he would like soar. Oh God, that's so cheesy. <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> 
<laughs> did not mean to use that. <laughs> Hey, hi, you guys. Hey. Really excited for Benison. Was going through a ton of people trying to decide who would be best for Benison based on the things that he's looking for. And I found some good candidates. Three people. I need you guys' help now deciding, okay? So the first person who I was thinking is Olivia. My name's Olivia. I'm originally from Boston, Massachusetts. I work in production. I love creating my own content. Um, going out there and shooting photos or video. I feel like my personality is a little assertive, kind of sarcastic, and sometimes I feel like it's a little too much for dudes out here in LA. I would love to find someone that is very goal-driven, so if that's you, you know who to call. <laughs> <laughs> so she's really funny. Uh -huh. Yeah. So the next person is Jolisa. Hi guys, my name is Jolisa. I am 26 years old. I am a unit secretary. Love what I do, love working in the hospital, love helping people. Oh, my friends would say I'm funny. They definitely say I'm laid back. I can be a bit stubborn sometimes. I guess a little bit of what I'm looking for in a partner is someone who's just as driven as I am, ambitious as I am. You have a good relationship with your family like I do with my family. So that's a little bit about me, and I'll see you soon. Nice. Yeah, she's so cute. She's very lovely. I think it's over. <laughs> no, Josh, show wait, me the next wait, 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 you cannot decide yet. I have one more person. <laughs> just give me a chance, just give me a chance. Because I think you might like Carrie too. Hello, my name is Carrie. I write comedy for TV, and I am an actor you know, when people decide to hire me. What I'm looking for in a partner is someone that can laugh. And also, I mean, it would be dope if he thought I was funny. Dope. That's actually dope. Like that, yeah. <laughs> oh, points for dope. Okay. Um, I would say that I'm really fun and I like to have fun. I'm not very good at this whole dating thing. I usually end up dating people that I already know. So this is terrifying, um, but I'm up for an adventure. <laughs> On that note, it was a pleasure. <laughs> she's cute too. Cutie pie. Yeah. 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 I want to hear from you, like your pros, your cons. Ooh, okay, yeah, so Olivia. Okay. She seems to have a very strong Boston personality. Yeah. And Benison is such a Cali boy. It's One thing she... I did like about her is that she's into content. Yes, and I know that's definitely. weird to say, but Benison is like documents his life too. Yeah. Guy. <laughs> okay, so give me some info on Julissa. I mean, she's beautiful, like family oriented. Benison's like always yes. with his family. Always. Mm -hmm. This would just be a wild card in terms of chemistry. And I just wonder if they would get along in person. Last but not least, Carrie. Carrie. Like she said the word dope. And Benison, <laughs> loved, he loved yeah, that I, word. <laughs> you guys were like, oh, yeah. you said dope. Pro, dope, yeah. okay. That would be one wild date. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would just want to like watch observe. that date. Yeah. <laughs> if they went on a date, at least they could either leave as friends or as like more than that. Mm -hmm. yeah. Whereas some mm -hmm. of the other ones I could see just like not working at all. Oh. Yeah. Okay, I see that. So what is it? You have to choose. I'm excited, anxious, nervous. Two people meeting each other just to meet each other and just hang out, like, there's nothing that can go wrong with that. It's a, it's a beautiful thing. Hi, how are you? How are you? Good, how are I'm you? Awesome. What's your name? Jolisa. Benison, hey. hey. Benison. Yo, yo. Or Joe for short, whichever one. Joe for short, which yes. do you prefer? Either or. But most people call me Joe. Okay. Honestly, I already forgot your name. You're gonna have to give it to me <gasps> one more time. Jolisa. Amazing. I'm gonna call you Jolisa. I like Jolisa. Thank you so much. You're looking awesome. Yellow's in Thank right you. now. Marigold is. is fire. In there like swimwear. You got it. You got it. You're swimming. <laughs> You're swimming. Well, I'm super stoked for this day. Me too. Where are we going? We are doing an escape room. Yeah. Have you done that before? I have never done an escape room. Oh, this is great. I've only done it once. Okay. But I think this will be fun. I think we'll it'll be fun too. We'll try to escape the room. You ready? Yes. Let's do this. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, we're about to escape. I know. We're about to break free from a room. What happens if we can't escape? Are they going to be like, well, sorry. I don't know what happens just... when we <laughs> don't escape. Yo, we've made it out to the escape room. Yes. You excited? I am excited. I'm pumped. We might not make it, so. I think we're gonna make it. You think so? Yeah. How do you spell Jolisa? J-O-L-E-S-A. Shout out to mom for dope name. Yeah. Is there a staircase there or something? There is a staircase. It looks like I'm people really of my nature tend to run from. <laughs> yeah, no. Uh-uh. Can you see that key? Like it weapon. does, right? <laughs> like, you can, like, all these open, right? Yeah. Oh, me. Oh. oh! Oh, that's good. Okay, 
okay, what okay. do I do with <laughs> this? I'm about to die. Okay. <laughs> I'm about to die. What is this? Oh, where does this door go to? <laughs> oh, does this open? Who's going in there? Let me see. You got you. I got you. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Oh, no. Yo. That was fantastic. It was a little scary, though. I was, how many? I was grabbing onto my date. <laughs> That's a scary part to do it. We just had a really nice walk. Yes, a and long, we made nice it to B Suite. It's dope. I like it. <laughs> it's pronounced hollow, hollow, not halo, halo. And I got the root beer flow, baby. It's good. Venison's really nice. Of course, he's handsome. Hopefully, we get to see each other again. Hopefully, we keep in contact and we see where it goes from here. Hi. Venison. How are you? Good. How you doing, love? I'm awesome. Okay, I hope the date was awesome. The date was sweet. It was sweet. Okay, give me some feedback. What? How was it? I think we had a lot more in common than I thought we would. It seems like there was a lot of chemistry between Joe Lisa and Venison. I can't believe like, he forgot her name. <laughs> Like right off the bat. We talked about music a little bit, which we like kind of got into. Culture was super cool. Um, just learning about like her family. We had a lot of common there. It was like we were friends already. From this experience, I think Benison learned to just be more open about his dating life. So then what about the romantic chemistry? The romantic chemistry, hmm. I don't think I was like in that realm, like balls to the walls, like oh, like dude, have to make this happen, like this is it. Like, <laughs> girl, Jalissa's like, I mean like, she has the swag that I really appreciate and like she's doing her thing. Like, like I feel like I would have to go on more dates. Okay. Yeah. I do think that this experience really helped Venice in having to like open up about his family. What's the best thing that could happen if you brought Jalisa home? Parents are stoked. They're like having a good time. They're learning about her. They're learning about my interests through her. And then it's more of like the conversation after. Like when I'm having a drink with dad when everyone's like sleeping, it's like, yo, that shit was fire. That girl's sweet. Like, I'm so glad you brought her home. I feel super confident about Benison and Jolisa. By the end of the date, they were hugging and like posing together in the selfies. I feel like they should um, go out again. Why not? You know? Are we going to go back out with her? Yeah, I think so. She's only been here for a month. She has so much of LA to see. Mm -hmm. Venison, I wish you the best of luck with Julissa. Board sounds like they did great. Trust your friends, let them in. I will see you later, good cool. luck. Awesome, thank you. <laughs> Bye. So pancake.